Hi everyone, how many of you guys have seen these on TV? This is an as seen on TV item or purchased it at Ross. I purchased this at Ross during the holidays. I'm always intrigued to save money or possibly use these outside on the porch this i have two maybe 19 inch tvs that i bought from rite aid when they closed in my area and these tvs are made by craig they probably didn't cost no more than 20 dollars and i've had them in my closet and that is what really intrigued me on buying one of these items. They say it, you could get uh, HD channels such as ABC, Fox, NBC. Everyone knows you could get PBS with the um, antennas. <laughs> and CW, they say it's full HD. 4k no more cable bills i would like to use these in one of my storage shed on the front porch on a deck in a bathroom i've already opened it it says no power required i'm not sure what that means connect to free TV for uh, free TV channels. Here is the way you secure it to the back of your TV or maybe a wall. I'm not sure for the antenna. I've already cut a slit out. Um. This was the price compared to $25. I paid 10 for this. So how can you not try it? <laughs> it's called Magic Stick TV. So I've already cut it open. And let's see. And I've already have the, I'm gonna put my phone down for a second. I have another one too. I have a smaller one that's magnetic in case I wanted to use this in the car. Super magnetic antenna. I guess it, you know, magnetic means it'll uh, stick to any metal car. And it's a, it's, this is a heavy one. And that's a huge magnet, as you can see advertises the same channels um this was the price 10 again no more cable bills the smaller one says the same thing made by the same person this one is just magnetic full range digital works anywhere horizontally or vertical full hd 4k digital hd hd tv antenna i'm trying this and i think this will be great for one of my storage sheds because i have a metal roof on one and the other one is just a metal building. So that intrigued me. And these things get gone. I have been seeing them in Ross for a long time. And when I would think about buying one and go back and get it, it would be gone. But they would quickly get them back in. And they only would get one. Uh, no more than two. And I was like, okay. And look at that. It says Telemundo. A lot of people say they learn Spanish watching that. 
But, um, yeah, they always get them. They have gotten some cheaper ones that I've tried before. Uh, but this, with it being so large, this is like over 24 inches. And it's heavy. And you see how it screws on. So, I'm going to get this out of the packaging. I'm not going to try to magnet it. We'll try that on another time. I have it out. And we're going to screw that to the back of the TV. This TV is upside down. And the way it goes in, you can see I have a stopping point here. See, I can prop that up. And when I try to put this in where it goes, I can't fit it in. And it's just too far. Uh, let me see. I'm going to see if I can slide this off or slide it down. Because the port there... Looks just like this one. The thread looks just like that. There's nothing to screw it on. Okay, that's why you follow directions. Um, <gasps> y'all, I got some cable. <laughs> This came with a lot of cable. But this doesn't come with cable. Oh my god. That look guys, look what I, look what popped out. This is the adapter. And this is the cable. And instructions. <laughs> We're in 13 minutes. Whew. Okay. There we go. There we go. There we go. Uh Okay, now I see why you have that. You want to put the antenna toward a window. I don't know what that is. You want to put the antenna toward a window, of course, uh, or outside if you can, to get a better, better signal. And then you have this cable. And you can put your TV where you normally run your TV, and I can run this outside. So uh, I may have to edit this. And I movie, I didn't want to, but let's see. Let's see. See that? There's that little part, and there is that part. So we're gonna pop this in. And excuse my hands for being ashy, guys. Screw that in. Still not reading instructions. I tell you the truth. Okay. My winter hands. We have the magic stick antenna connected, and that's that rubber stripping. And this part right here is where you can probably secure it to a window seal or a door hinge. The door frame to get a better uh, suction. Um, and we got the part behind the TV. Now, with me no not having a, I may delete this and start over. Um, yeah, I have to have them remotes. I do. What is this remote thing? I might have this remote. This is my tackle box I got from Ross that has a lot of my remotes. Let's see if I'm lucky. That's my fan air condition. And these little small remotes that go to who knows. Okay, 
turn the power on. That's how I have it hooked at the back. That's what this is, a Craig 19-inch HD LED TV. Oh. <laughs> wow. Okay, there we go. That's when you try to, you know, do Ah, here we go, here we go. Let's see what we get. HDMI, you guys can see that. No signal. So it's not recognizing the you know. Let's see what we have here. Volume menu channel. Source. Source. Let's hit the source button. HDMI. No, it's not HDMI. Um... Menu. Um, I finally got it to auto scan. And got the, I mean, with no remote, I'm going to have to get a universal remote. <laughs> but I have it on channel and scanning. We have a long way to go. I uh, still have not read any directions. Um, I do have the antenna at the window, and that is a very long cord that this comes with. We have 21 channels. Um, I'm excited. great for a porch if if it really does get a good channel a porch you want to get some sun um the, the my storage sheds a deck to take with you on the road because as long as you have an acdc uh, outlet and they make those now for cigarette lighters where you could plug up the tv look at that oh my Beautiful camping. Oh my goodness. Let's turn around because your girl ain't got no remote. Yeah. WI. Story. Whatever that is. HSN. <gasps> Another story. HSN. WHNS. Oh my goodness, that looks so good. I think we had over 20 channels. Restored by students to compete at Pebble Beach. And having been someone that has prepared cars Restoring TVs. But with the right partner, you can be Cozy TV. Clickgranger.com or just stop by Granger. Never heard of that channel. Let's see if we get some channels that we that we're used to escape. Bounce. Well, we don't need to see what comes out. Grit. Oh, that is. The 365. PBS. Rottle. PBS Kids. It's taking its time to come in, but I'm sure it's going to come in. Let's see. It's coming in. So I'm glad you kept your promise. <laughs> Not the best one to come in. Of course. Okay, here we go. Control what the kids can watch. They don't have access to the cable. It doesn't work that good, but NCCHL. Uh, let's see what this is. And I may have to outside being outside or using the car is going to be perfect, especially that magnetic antenna I have. That's PBS. ETVs, they show good. ETVs. 
on the garden channels. Okay. Well, I don't have. He said I should have NBC. That is some football. I don't have that CW. Is it worth it for $10? Yes. And thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.